Hi guys, my name's John. Uh, with me here is Medusa, our alligator snapping turtle, who does live here in our bayou exhibit at Gopharium Marine Adventure Park. Now, alligator snapping turtles are a very, very cool species of turtle. They do find their home here in Florida and throughout a lot of the southeast and even into parts of the midwestern United States. Now, they're one of the largest species of freshwater turtle in the world. Now, Medusa, she's a female. So she's not going to get quite as big as some males can. She was around 48 pounds when we weighed her last, but there have been males recorded at weighing sizes of over 200 pounds. Now getting a good look inside Medusa's mouth here, you do see the tip of her tongue has a pink fleshy appendage on that. Now that tongue is what's called a vermiform tongue, and it is used to basically lure fish inside of her mouth thinking that that tongue is a worm, thinking that they have a nice easy meal, where then that alligator snapping turtle can chomp down with tremendous amounts of force and eat that fish. But fish aren't the only things that alligator snapping turtles consume. They are opportunistic feeders, so they are not picky at all. They will eat live fish, dead fish, uh, small mammals, crustaceans, mollusks, other reptiles. If they can eat that animal without expending a lot of energy, they will take advantage of that situation. Now alligator snapping turtles are called alligator snapping turtles, not because they're part alligator, but instead uh, just by some characteristics of these guys. So again, a very, very incredibly powerful jaw like you do see on alligators, but also this shell. Now the shell, uh, the top of the shell here, the carapace, uh, these bony ridges on their back are very indicative of alligator snapping turtles. Now these bony ridges resemble the backs of American alligators, like the osteoderms on them, just those bony rows. And alligator snapping turtles have very, very pronounced bony rows or scoots on their back. Also this very long tail that these guys have here too. Very almost alligator-like that they have. Now, as mentioned before, alligator snapping turtles do inhabit certain parts of the state of Florida up here in the Panhandle. But since they do have such a small range here in the state, they're actually a protected species in the state of Florida, uh, which does prohibit private individuals from owning the animals as well as from being hunted in the state of Florida as well.